Morning, guys. I'm Steve. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time stopping by the channel, hit that subscribe button. Trust me, you won't regret it. If you're a returning subscriber, as always, guys, welcome back, and I do appreciate the support. Guys, I was in the middle of doing another video, and this uh, just came across the news feed. I figured I'd jump on this quick because it just this news just broke. A uh, high school teacher out there in the Miami Dade area, shout out Miami Dade, and uh, from Ronald Reagan High School, this guy pictured here, 45 years old, Wesley Alvarez. This guy is a teacher, supposedly at Ronald Reagan High School, like I said before, and he has uh, been caught and arrested for doing some of the stupidest stuff. Somebody that's 45 years old, you wouldn't think would have in their head. But then again, morals are something that's missing in most of society nowadays. This guy right here, ladies and gentlemen, was arrested for, you know what? Take a look at this. You ain't going to believe it. How stupid can you be? Check it. Also developing at noon, a Miami Dade teacher arrested after an alarming incident. He's accused of making a pornographic video on school grounds, and local 10 News reporter Roy Ramos is live outside the school where the teacher worked at in Doral with the disturbing details. Janice and Christy, and when you hear of these allegations, it's really upsetting, especially when this teacher works with students, children really, on a daily basis. Let's go ahead and show you what he looks like. You're looking at the mugshot of 45-year-old Wesley Alvarez. He is who Miami-Dade Schools police said exposed himself in front of a mirror inside of a school bathroom. Now, police said this all happened at Ronald Reagan Senior High School yesterday. What has placed him behind bars is students at Alvarez who is a teacher at the school, posted video of himself doing this on the social media platform Snapchat. Students now brought this to the attention of the school resource officer and the principal, and when they realized that Wesley was allegedly wearing the same clothing as in the video, he was arrested. Now, Alvarez did face a judge in bond court just a few moments ago. That judge did find probable cause and ordered that he have no unsupervised contact with children. We've also reached out to the district who issued this statement that read, Miami Dade public schools is aware of a video of this individual circulating on social media. As soon as the district became aware of these disturbing allegations, an investigation was launched and the individual was subsequently arrested. Conduct such as the one he is accused of will not be tolerated. As such, his employment with the district is being terminated and we will ensure he is precluded from seeking further employment, future employment rather, with Miami-Dade Public Schools. Alvarez is now behind bars, now facing a bond of $7,500. He still has yet to post that bond, but when he does, we'll be sure to ask him about those allegations. For now, here in Doral, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's the story of Mr. Wesley Alvarez, age 45, out of Miami-Dade uh, area in Florida. How stupid can you be? I mean, seriously. Who, who thinks of doing that? You that turned up or, or craving attention that you do and you put your you risk your job. And put your reputation on the line and not only as a teacher, but as a man. To do something like that. He goes into a front of a school mirror, beats his dick like it owes him money and then runs and puts it on Snapchat. How much attention you need? I don't even know nothing about this guy. If he's married or has kids, because this story just broke, guys. But think about this, especially you ladies out there. Could you imagine the embarrassment and shame when you hear why your husband don't go to work no more? What happened? Ah, I quit. Then you find out. You call up there one day and find out, or somebody calls the house, and you find out what your husband was doing. Embarrassing. And what if this guy got kids, man? That don't, man, that looks real bad. I know his parents probably like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? That's the thing. People focus on the person that do the stuff, but the people that are around them, that are family, that could support them in their time of need, whether they make a mistake or not, sometimes you just got to back off for people. You did what? Man, could you imagine if that was my son? If he was my son and I found out he did that, I'd be like, don't come over my house. Don't talk to me. Don't call. I don't want nobody to know. I'm not messing with you. No, but you done with me. You know what I'm saying? Goes in front of a mirror. 
does his expose itself, puts it on Snapchat, gets arrested in the same school clothes that he had on, and then does it in a way where other kids can wind up seeing it. They see it, go to the principal, now the whole school know you look hella dumb. You do. You locked up. You in the holding pen with everybody else. Everybody going around the room. Hey, man, what you get locked up for? One dude over there. Oh, I got locked up for bank robbery. What you get locked up? Oh, aggravated assault. What you do over here? Oh, I did kidnapping. What you do over here? I shot somebody. Hey, you, uh, my man, what you do? Uh, I jerked off in front of a camera, uh, in front of a mirror, and, and I put it on Snapchat. Man, that beat the hell out you in there. I wish I knew this man. The way I am, I wish I knew this dude. Like on a personal level, I would clown the hell out of him. Every time he made a statement about anything dealing with teaching, social media, I'd flame broil him. I'd crack so many jokes, he'd be ready to fight. I'd dig right into him. How stupid can you be? Seriously. What is going on? Like, I don't mean to offend nobody, but what is going on out there in Miami-Dade area? It seems like security guards are doing crazy stuff. Sexual, and it's always in school. Security guards, teachers messing with the students. Man, what? What? And I know this goes on all over the place, but I mean, as of late, it's like almost every time I look at local 10 news or whatever it is that outlet is out there that I'm subscribed to on YouTube. It's like every time I get on there, it's like something with a student or, or, or teacher. I mean, is it that bad? I, somebody make this make sense for real. In fact, let's do it like this because y'all like comment. And I like I like reading y'all comments. I want my ladies out there to comment. If you were his wife and you found out that he did this, how would you handle that and how would you feel? I'm anxious to see how, how a woman's side of this, like, you know, if this guy was your husband or something, what kind of psychological damage that would have? I mean, the relationship be over. Or, or guys, you could comment. What would you do if this was your son? How would you handle him? Now, he's 45 years old. You ain't going to beat on him. But how would you handle this situation getting that embarrassing word that your son did something crazy like this? Man, I would just leave my child alone. Like, bro, it's no getting past that. I, what, what, what I heard, I can't unhear. And what I see, well, I ain't going to see it. But you understand what I'm saying? Just a picture in your mind when somebody tell you, hey, uh, sorry, sir, but your grown ass man, son, uh, got caught. Drink it off in a public restroom in school. But he's supposed to be teaching class. Uh, that's not a good look. They said as soon as he bond out, they're going to be right there to question him. So that means people sitting outside the jailhouse right now. Hey, there he is right there. That's the guy that played with his dick at school. Get him. <laughs> they put the camera on him and shit. I want to see it. Embarrassing. I'm Stock Market Steve for the Dynamic Reason channel. As always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. It's like, man, people are losing their minds nowadays. I mean, social media is like a gift and it's like a hell of a curse. It's like some people can't get past wanting just the attention of doing, and they do crazy stuff for attention, man. Seriously. That, bro, you an educated man in a school, got a certain level of responsibility and you negate all that to pull your dick out in front of a mirror and beat it. I'm done. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.